we're going to draw the structural and condensed formula for uh, 3, 4, diethyl hexane. So the first thing we do is we're going to go to the family name uh, hexane, which has the uh, six carbons. So we're going to draw the six carbons in series. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to number these carbons. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, we know that uh, on uh, carbon number three and carbon number four, we have uh, an ethyl group. So, di means uh, we have ethyl groups and di means we have two groups and those two groups are on carbon number three and carbon number four. So let's, uh, on carbon number three, we have, uh, uh, let's just extend this. We have uh, uh, ethyl comes from ethane, which has uh, two carbons, okay? So we have uh, this one's two carbons. And on carbon number four, we also have an ethyl group, which also have uh, uh, two carbons. Let me just extend this. To look clean. So we have uh, two carbons here. These are the branches. Okay. And now we have done that, we can just uh, fill in with uh, the hydrogen atoms that are connected to each of these uh, carbon atoms. In some cases, it's not necessary to put the hydrogens. Anyone who understands chemistry, uh, organic chemistry, will understand uh, what is supposed to be there. But so this is how uh, this, and so we have uh, this ethyl group here at uh, carbon number three, and we have this uh, ethyl group here at carbon number four. So that's uh, that's the the structural formula. This one is the structural formula. It looks uh, threatening when you have, uh, when you see the name like that, but when you put it down, it, it, it just uh, fits in. Now, the condensed formula is just condensing this into uh, the way they are. Uh, for example, carbon number one is connected to three hydrogens, so we can write uh, this like that. Uh, carbon number two is connected only to two hydrogens, so we can write like uh, that. Carbon number three is connected to one hydrogen. And also it has a, this ethyl group, which is a two hydrogen, two carbons, and a five hydrogens. And then carbon number four is connected to one hydrogen. And also it has this uh, group, which has a uh, two carbons and five hydrogens. And then we come to carbon number five, which has a two hydrogens. Carbon number six has a three hydrogens. And so that's the condensed formula for, for this compound. Okay, so straightforward.